Good morning. This is what my man does <laughs> when I am fasting. Yeah, it's a chocolate cake. <sighs> so yeah, can y'all see it now? <laughs> y'all, he ate a piece in front of me last night. I should have recorded it. Like, it was, oh my God. Oh my God. Like, y'all don't even understand. Anyway, uh, I will be breaking my fast today with tacos. Y'all already know. Happy freaking Monday. Y'all, don't that look good? It's from Kroger. He says the best chocolate cake he ever had, ever. He said it tastes homemade. I'm like, what? Y'all know Kroger's got the best cakes, though, so. So, we're going to do some fun stuff with these ripe, super ripe bananas. We're not going to go to waste at all. And, yeah, I can't freaking wait. I just had to come and say this. Like, I just made an Instacart order. I needed some red wine. I should just went and got it. That's what I'm going to have to do. But I needed some red wine, okay? And the only reason I made an order is to get that red wine. Guess what? They didn't have it. Oh, I'm so freaking. I don't understand. Like, oh my God. And then they didn't even message me. I didn't even like get an alert saying that we don't, they don't have this. Would you like something else? Like nothing. Yeah. So I got all the rest of that stuff for nothing <laughs> and I still need red wine oh boy y'all already have everything like everything I'm gonna cook this week I already have it mapped out what I'm gonna cook everything I have the ingredients everything except for that red wine of course I may not be able to do that um that um dinner that I'm trying to do with um that red wine because um I mean, it's kind of intricate. It's not like an easy freaking dinner. But we're going to see. We're going to see. I'll probably go get the red wine today. I don't know. We'll see, though. All right, so I just got this in. Just got this in. Can y'all wait? All right, let me show y'all my new pot. It is so freaking nice, y'all. Y'all, look at this bad boy. It's a freaking walk. Never mind the daggone stove. But look at that. Isn't that freaking nice? Ooh! Like, this is freaking, like, really heavy, this top is. But, um, yeah, you could use it for more than just a walk. It's multi-purpose. So, yeah, watch me use it, baby. All right, y'all. So, we are making Lulu's tacos today. All right, so... I have my meat here to um, to cut. This is beef skirt steak, and it's already tenderized, so I'm gonna be doing both of these, okay? So, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this. And you're supposed to just cut it just like how I'm cutting it, y'all. I got this uh, recipe off of TikTok. It ain't nothing but a couple of ingredients. And everything goes into one pot. So, so excited about that. And no, she didn't even um, season it before she put it in the, uh, the pan. She's going to season it. Well, I'm going to season it after we put it in the pan. So y'all, I was not feeling good not that long ago. Like my chest was hurting. Like I was like, what is going on here? What is going on? Let me turn y'all more this way. There we go. This is fine, just like that. Now, let me go wash this and I'll be right back. All right, y'all, so I'm putting 
everything that I cut into this one bowl. And now I'm gonna grab a medium-sized yellow onion and a poblano pepper. All right, y'all, so we're gonna cut one yellow onion and this poblano pepper. It's supposed to be a medium yellow onion, but I only have small ones. You could do two small, but I'm just doing one. Remember, I could have used my uh, my chopper. Uh, oh well, it's not a big deal. Y'all, my vegetable chopper is on my Amazon storefront, just in case, honey. You need that in your life. All right, let's go wash this. We just gonna chop this up. I've never used poblano pepper in anything, y'all. So this is a first for me. I hope it's good. Chop it this way. Now I'm throwing everything in the one bowl, y'all. Um, next, I'm gonna grab a whole pack of bacon. And chop that up also. Okay. 
in there. Clean this up. Then we're going to go in the fridge. Grab the bacon. And y'all literally, I do believe this is it. I'm just, since this is a pound of bacon, I'm just gonna use half of it because I need to use this for something else this week. So, we're gonna, dang, I could have just halved it like that. Anyway, I'm gonna put it back in there. So I'm just gonna half it like so. Put that back in there. And we're gonna just chop this up in pieces. And we're gonna throw everything in at once, y'all. get this throw that bad boy in there like that and we're gonna walk over to the pot people all right oh and we're also gonna um chop up some cilantro i'm not gonna do it right now um because this we have to cook uh, <laughs> we have to cook this first okay and then we're gonna throw that in after it's cooked so I'm just gonna like scissor it in after I'm done cooking this. All right, y'all. So no, we're not gonna put any oil in here. We just gonna saute everything together. She says you don't need no oil because you're using bacon, baby. Oh, this is nice. my god it smells good already um all right and she also says to add a um bouillon cube and you can season it whatever you want to but she says to add Add a chicken bouillon cube, and I'm gonna put one of these saison packets in there. This one. And I'm gonna add a little bit of Oh, Put some um cayenne in here also. You know how we like spots. Cayenne people, cayenne. All right, so we're gonna add. We're 
add this chicken bouillon cube. I want to get it on my nails, y'all. Because it will stain your freaking fingers. But I do not need that before I do a video. Mix that up in there. God, this pot is so sturdy, y'all. I freaking love it. Let me out back a little bit. All right, y'all, I'll be back when this is done. I see it right in here. This is on my Amazon storefront, y'all. List it in the description box.
cooking great. Actually making like gravy or something. So, I had a top on it so I can make sure the onions are cooked all the way through and the poblano peppers and the bacon, of course. And she says when everything is cooked, just to put some um, cilantro all in the pot. Are y'all cricket? If y'all are, I'm sorry. some more because I don't know the bacon I don't know I want to make sure the bacon is cooked all the way through you know let me cook it just a little bit longer alright y'all so this is it I'm about to chop my cilantro and put it on in there my onions and my poblano peppers are cooked all the way through. The bacon's cooked all the way through. Let's do it. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. Turn it down. And I'm gonna stir the cilantro up in there. Yes, I cut mine really rough. You're supposed to chop it, but it's fine. Yummy, freaking delicious. This is it, y'all. This is it. And then you just stuff your tacos. I'm gonna let y'all see me do that. All right. Turn your heat all the way down. All right, y'all. So I'm about to make my tacos. I'm going to use some cheese, y'all. I want to use some cheese today, okay? This reminds me of the Oaxaca cheese. It's so freaking good. So we're gonna put that at the bottom layer of the taco. So when I put my meat on here, it's just gonna melt the taco. I mean, melt the, <laughs> the cheese. I need to be using some um, vegan cheese, but I don't feel like it today. All right, here go my pico, pico de gallo, baby. Don't play with your girl. Don't play with your girl. All right, I have to warm up my shows. Um, It don't need to be drained. Oh, I thought this was the drainage spoon. No, it don't have to be drained. She didn't drain hers. You, you gotta go handle it. <laughs>
delicious i have my pico pico de gallo yes honey who wants a yummy bite what up y'all so we just finished doing the video not that long ago um did some um snack videos on tiktok uh, so stay tuned for when i put those out me and marshall um like try some snacks we still got some more uh stuff that we need to try but anyway Dang, these daggone lashes, y'all. Whenever I put the lashes like too close in here, it always feels like I have something in my eye. That is so annoying. I wish I had my own eyelashes, y'all. I swear to God, I would not wear these eyelashes if I had my own. I just, I don't like wearing eyelashes. I really don't. They irritate me. It's been, especially on this side. It always feels like I have an eyelash in my eye, like right here every time anyway so yeah um what else is going on um i think that's about it if anything else oh i need to watch um bad girls uh what was it y'all forgot that it is it it's not bad girls club because y'all know what i'm talking about natalie natalie nunn's uh show on zeus I forgot to watch it yesterday, so I'm going to watch it today. And yeah, y'all. So yeah, this is my hair from, um, did I even tell y'all I did a, uh, I washed my hair? Did I tell y'all? I think I did, yeah. Um, and y'all, I like stretched my hair and like blow dried it. That's why it has this length to it because if I didn't do that, like my washing go would like be up to here. You know what I'm saying? But I like the uh, blow dry thing. You do. You kind of like take out some of the definition. But anyway, um, I'm putting that video though of um, my wash and go and the results and stuff on my um, natural hair obsession channel. I'm gonna start uploading like my natural hair stuff over there. I may even do some waves over there. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. But yeah, y'all make sure y'all go and subscribe over there but yeah y'all i'm about to go um and i'll be back later one more thing y'all look at this necklace that we're gonna show probably so freaking cute y'all been wanting a tennis necklace forever and he got it for me y'all like he gave it to me the other day i didn't show y'all immediately because i didn't know if i wanted to or not but anyway yes y'all i freaking love it it is bling blinding can y'all even see I love it. Anyway, yeah. Hey, y'all. Looky, looky. We're going to try this. Y'all know we don't drink like how we used to, but we going to try this, honey. Pineapple chili? Are you kidding me? Look at that. Semi-sweet. Delicious. 